guys, today I'm going to be sharing my thoughts, opinions, and feels on Jacoby by William Ritter. This is a fantasy historical fiction young adult book that follows a girl named Abigail who has just arrived in New England in 1892 and is in major need of a job. She comes across a man named Jacoby who is a very strange investigator. He has the ability to see these strange supernatural creatures. He's in need of an assistant and Abigail takes on the job. There's a serial killer on the loose and Jacoby and Abigail are hitting the case hardcore trying to figure out who this serial killer is or if maybe it's some sort of supernatural creature. Ooh, ah. I had a fun time reading this book, but that's about it. If you're wanting a book that will blow your mind, this probably isn't the book you're looking for, but if you're looking for just a fun little adventure, then I would definitely pick this book up. So first off, let's talk about the writing. I had a little bit of an issue with the writing. For the most part, it was fine, but there were a few things that irked me a little bit. The first thing being the repetitive dialogue that I picked up on. It just got a bit annoying as I found several different cases where this was happening throughout the book. I understand there being a few moments where this takes place, but I just saw it happening way too often where there were just things that kept being repeated and I was just like, why is this necessary? I also didn't find that the setting was described very well. This book takes place in 1892, but it honestly just felt like it could have been taken place in modern day because we didn't get very many descriptions as to what the character's surroundings looked like. Let's talk about the plot. I thought the plot was simple, but I also thought it was the strongest part of this book. We have this very mysterious case that Jacoby and Abigail are following and it kept me intrigued as different things started to unravel with this case. Another great thing about the plot is that it was super fast paced. Things were happening like bam 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 making it really exciting and interesting and just a very fast read. Now let's talk about the characters. I don't know how I really feel about the characters still. I wasn't a huge fan of Jacoby as much as I wanted to like him. I just didn't really like him that much but I did really like Abigail and I feel like she really balanced him out. Jacoby was just such a peculiar character and I found him to be a bit annoying at times. He was just all over the place and I wanted him just to kind of focus and not be all over the place. He's kind of a bit of a mess. Yes, he's smart and yes, he's observant and a great detective, but he was just a bit too much for me at times. I really liked Abigail's character. I feel like she had similar qualities to Jacoby, but she was just a much more well put together character and wasn't annoying at all. I never got annoyed reading her character, which was nice because I got annoyed sometimes with Jacoby, but I really liked the dynamic between Jacoby and Abigail, I feel like they really balanced each other out. You've got Jacoby, who is a wacky madman, and then you've got Abigail, who is more put together. And I just think that their personalities worked together, and they worked well as a team. So those were my thoughts, opinions, and feels on <laughs> Jacoby by William Ritter. You guys should let me know down below if you read this book and what you thought of it. Did you like it, or did you have a few issues with it? Let me know down below, and I will see you guys soon with a new video. <laughs> Later. <laughs> got a cold. So I'm feeling all I got sneeze. <sighs> It went away. What? No, it went away. I hate, oh, I hate when you have to sneeze and then it just goes away. Like that drives me insane. She cut it up.